Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Data Cloud Now. I'm currently in Las Vegas, where I'm delighted to be joined by Doug Fight, Vice President of Channel Management at TransUnion. Doug, such a pleasure to be back with TransUnion here today. Ryan, great to be with you. Appreciate it. Doug, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is the third time that TransUnion has joined us on Data Cloud Now in 2024. Why do we keep seeing your team at these events, and why are you investing in the data clouds? I believe it is the third time we've seen you guys at, at these events. Uh, we must be doing something right because you continue <laughs> to invite us back. Fundamentally, we continue to invest in our partnerships in the, within the cloud environment. Both Snowflake and AWS are very valuable partners of ours. We believe that if we are not making our solutions available where our customers store, share, and analyze their data, then we're not allowing them to take the full value of those solutions. Most folks, I believe, know TransUnion as a credit bureau. We're very proud of our heritage as a credit bureau, but over the past several years, we've invested in our own technology and invested through some acquisitions to greatly diversify the portfolio of solutions that we bring to our customers. Beyond those credit use cases, we also help them solve marketing, fraud and risk, and contact center use cases. Being able to bring the diverse set of solutions to our customers and the environments in which they, again, store and analyze their data just adds a tremendous amount of value to our business. Totally agree. And how does the AI Data Cloud's ease of use make this a reality for TransUnion, Doug? Yeah, I, I think that falls into two major buckets. One, I think is the somewhat obvious, the technology benefits, right? It's easier to ingest and bring a solution into your environment if it's available within that environment right. already. Fewer resources, less questions from internal team to bring that data in and use it, and the additional control that it provides the users of that data. And then increasingly what we see is the cloud platforms are the hub to a spoke of an array of solutions. Whether it's AI solutions, machine learning, uh, just the cloud platforms that our, that our customers are inv investing in, clean rooms, you name it. If you're integrated within the clouds, it just makes it easier to take advantage of those solutions for our customers. Our customers bring use cases to us. We want to be able to jointly solve them with our technology partners, and it's a win for everybody. Great to hear, Doug. As AI moves into this next stage of implementation, how essential is it to have a well-rounded data foundation to harness its true potential? Well, it's like you listen to our conversation <laughs> that trains We know each other quite well at yeah, this point. That, that's exactly it. You hit the nail on the head, right? We believe that you can invest in the greatest technology that's out there, but if you're not building that data foundation properly, at best, you're not getting the most out of that investment, and at worst, you're wasting that investment. At TransUnion, we believe that a fundamental piece of that data foundation is a complete view of the customer. No matter how you're interacting with that customer, we want to be able to provide insights into what you're doing and add value into how you're interacting with those consumers. That applies across all of the use cases. In marketing, if you don't get identity right, you're going to waste marketing dollars and valuable consumer interactions. On the risk and fraud side, if you don't know who's on the other side of that transaction, you risk asking too many questions, making it too frictionful of a transaction, or not even getting that transaction done. And on the contact center side, it's imperative to know who's the, on the other side of that call, whether it's an inbound or outbound use case. Being able to solve all of those use cases with that data foundation helps you get the full value of what you're investing in the cloud. Great insights, thank you for that, Doug. What advice would you like to give to the audience who are looking to future-proof their business through a proper data foundation? Well, first of all, make sure you're investing in that data foundation. I won't rehash that again, but it's hugely important. And then what we find is our customers that are getting the most value out of that data foundation within the cloud is they're not making just a technology decision. Clearly, cloud purchases are made by technology departments at our customers and brands, but if you're not making those investments, by bringing along the marketing, product, fraud, legal compliance, you name it, departments, and doing that in a silo because it's just better technologically, you're not going to get the full value out of what you're doing. Again, it's all about being able to jointly solve those use cases for consumers between the data foundation and the cloud and making sure all of those internal parties are invested within our brands. Great perspective, Doug. Before we wrap, what's next for TransUnion? Well, uh, I'm a, I manage channel partnerships, so obviously from my perspective, it's future investment in the clouds. That includes finding creative ways to go to market and solve those customer needs, as well as investing in the innovation within the clouds. We're just sort of scratching the surface of how easy I believe we can make it to deliver 
those solutions to our customers, and we're going to lean into that more and more as we go into 2025, and we're excited about what the future holds. Doug, always a pleasure sitting down with TransUnion. Thank you so much for joining me today. Thanks, Ryan. Really appreciate the time. And for the audience watching, I'm Ryan Green with Data Cloud Now. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you soon.